guys and welcome to this week's episode of Scorpius Corner. So we just got back from FanCon. Literally and just got back. So amazing and mind blowing. We decided we have to do a Scorpius Corner about it. Right now. Yeah. FanCon was absolutely amazing guys, from the cosplay, to the stalls, to the artists, to the guests, to the geek quiz, to the, the, the panelses, the, the, the panelses, the panelses, the panelses, the panelses, the panelses was and the performances, that's, that's what we want to say. Yeah, um, both of them were amazing. It was mind blowing. If you thought FanCon was awesome in 2016, it blew it out of the water this year compared to the previous year. It was, it oh, it was so cool. I was tired by the end. I was. It was a combination. In a good way. It was a combination of sad, being sad, and being happy that it's the last day of Echo because we were tired. But I didn't want the end. Yeah. It was so much fun. All the people, the vibe. It was. Oh, what? It felt like everyone was like all the vendors took so long to pack up at the end because it felt like no one actually wanted to leave. Until and don't forget the impromptu dance party between with, yeah, Ed, with, the, with the Hogwarts students and Deadpool. It was, it was just so much fun. Um, I don't know, what was your favorite part? The cosplayers that stayed in character, that was... I, I look out for that and I enjoy that the most. Especially there's the one Deadpool that always stays in character. I, he walks around with a selfie stick and he's always in character and it's amazing. And especially the performances where people doing dancing and breaking out and not being shy and just being themselves. To the, the tracer, characters. to the tracer that fell on stage and well stayed done. in character. Well done. I thought you would you should have won yeah. just because of that. Because that was, so great though. That was like that was a hard fall. Yeah. And you owned it and stayed completely in character as Tracer. I thought I literally thought up and up until up until she got up and and limped off stage, I thought it was all part of the act. He was I, I was like wow <laughs> and it was like oh crap she really got hurt. But luckily Anna was there to yeah. heal her. Yeah, the cosplay was basically my favorite part and specifically the performances and the way people say in characters. I just find it incredibly entertaining and amazing and it blows my mind. I really missed being in cosplay this year uh, because we were dressed as NPCs for our competition. By the way, the winner of our competition was... She was actually the first person to show up at, at FanCon and hand in her quest. So. Seems the early well bird gets the 300 amazing. grand gift voucher. Apart from that, thank you to everyone that came to us to hand in your quest. You guys were awesome. A special thank you to the two guys that showed up and did this whole thing that they worked out. Yeah. Um, you were amazing. After after only finding out about the uh, about the quest at the table, they went and watched the video and then came back with this epic. I, I was like, I really wanted you guys to win. It was a lucky draw. We did the video. Didn't we? Yes, we did. Yeah. So after battling the arms of the Legion for Hengston Artifact from Buldan himself, we had managed to successfully catch you on the blurb side. But it was amazing. So well done to you guys. Thank like, you. Thank you guys. <laughs> it was um, amazing. My favorite part of the convention was everything. <laughs> Uh, honestly, I know it's not an answer, no. but no, you have to choose honestly, I I have the, to the cosplay, the cosplay was amazing, the vibe was amazing, the, vibe. the guests were amazing, um, the the panels were amazing, everything was amazing. I love. It was going, very inspired. By I was, the panels, actually. I was, I love going to FanCon, and I can't wait for this just to blow up and be the best thing ever. Uh, on that note. The only thing we could really think of for the future was the exact same, the exact same thing, but bigger. It's just like times two more. or four, it's just like one what was everything really cool. and more. Yes, what was really cool is this year there was the, uh, we had our first uh, international cosplayer. Cosplay. I mean, the, the first year we had international comic book artists and stuff. This year we had international comic book artists and an international uh, cosplayer, so which, next year? which was amazing. So next year, how about some international YouTubers? Yay! That, we would there's, love that. There's, there's really some people I would love to meet. I mean, okay. you guys know we love YouTube. We love other YouTubers. 
there's some people we would just just yeah how about some international youtubers that i think be that would amazing. be really amazing and then what also happened of course what do you get at a at a convention merch we got some merch yeah. now some of the stuff i won i answered some questions at the geek quiz he's a um so so so, so I, I i won some stuff and we got some prints so the merch we got we actually got it on the wall over here so if Mareka moves out of the way <laughs> we, we got this very cute uh griffin over here from valencia phillips thank you very much and this amazing amazing mccree print um from steven Spin, spin us. Sorry, dude, I can't remember the yours. And uh, but I know Steven, Steven because I'm Steven. Steven. Yes. Uh, so that was awesome. Then I got myself a Ravenclaw tie. He's very proud. Yes, Michael. Ravenclaw for the win. <laughs> we might have to do a Hogwarts student cosplay in the future. Yes. Then of course we have the awesome souvenir booklets that uh, everyone got, but it was, these were still amazing. And the art on this is amazing. The Even the art on our amazing. tags that we got was awesome just guys you you blew you blew fancon out of the water honestly you blew everyone out of the water <laughs> and then and then like the prizes i got i i got this awesome catwoman action figure and some awesome star wars stuff that i want like we're watching so, a movie tonight yeah <laughs> thank you for an amazing weekend guys thank you to everyone that showed up to all, all the, the international guests, guests. That, that made their way here you were amazing you were inspiring uh there were so many people we connected with and talked to that inspired us just to be better at everything <laughs> uh, so thank you so much to everyone who made the effort all the cosplayers who spent months on their outfits we loved you and loved looking at you and we enjoyed your outfits so thank there you so much for dressing up it was amazing and just thank you for everyone for coming and being part of the quest and meeting us and being thoroughly enjoyed ourselves this weekend yes so hopefully we see you guys next year at pancon and it's bigger and better and more amazing and we all go on this journey together yeah see you there links to our facebook and twitter and everything else is in the description below if you like the video remember to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and we'll catch you guys on the flip side yeah catch you on the flip side <laughs> Hey there guys, this is just a reminder, this was just our Scarpy's Corner about FanCon. Be sure to check out the full vlog of the entire convention next week Monday. That's just to be better at everything. <laughs> Somebody <laughs> handed in a quest, I don't have any quests anymore. Oh. Uh, it fell off. Okay. <laughs> I was like, wait, my peripheral vision is not... <laughs>